guys and good morning. It's time to go. We have been here way too long. Two <laughs> months, man. Two yeah. months. The sun decided not to come back. It's you know, a sign. It's, it's, a time, it's time for us to go. <laughs> Yo también, te quiero. Yo te ofendí. Up to the brim. I don't know if you've noticed how frugal Omar is. So not only we are like departing super late to get a Euro tunnel at 6 in the morning, so like we're driving overnight there and then apparently sleeping in the car. This is our radio. And he like couldn't spend some money in getting a speaker so I could connect my phone to it. Dab have radio, it's gonna be amazing. <laughs> Through customs, yay! Really easy. We didn't even check our own NHS app, which was uh, yeah. Are you vaccinated? Yes. yes. <laughs> Most people could be quite hyped now. So good. Yay! yay. This is a precautionary measure while the shuttle continues its crossing. What do you reckon? So we are leaving now. Morning everyone. Good morning. We have a cafe au lait. A croissant. Really, really nice croissant. A little bit more awake now. We're continuing the route. It was somewhere I really wanted to go, which was like this. It looked like a vineyard area, but let's see what happens. Enchanté. You know when you're like watching a movie set in France, I don't know if any of us watched Chocolat with Johnny Depp and it's like this quaint beautiful village with all these stone houses. It's definitely like that. It's really amazing. This is where we're heading and there's loads of camping places there and they're quite cheap. It's going to cost, apparently, I'll confirm later, 20 euros for both of us to set up a tent and then I think it includes electricity access. And camping in Europe, amazing. Looking forward to it, Omar? Yes, very much so. <laughs> Omar's and driving so he can't can, really... And I've got to remember to drive on the right. Cool, we'll see you there. Yo! Woo. Oh, this is a comfortable chair. Cool guys, we're just gonna have some nice tom yum and noodle soup. Omar is very tired, he needs to have a rest and then we'll catch up tomorrow with a little bit more of this area of France. Good night, <laughs> see you in the morning. See you. Good morning everyone. Well we had a lovely sleep last night, there were quite a few mosquitoes. It's good preparation for Portugal. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna have some breakfast now and then we're gonna carry on, go more south. It feels like a good day, I feel wide awake and I've got loads of energy so. Okay. Alrighty. <laughs> Butter. 
All right, guys, so we've had a great morning this morning. We've had a lovely breakfast and we are now packed up the tent and ready to go. So where are we going? To the lake. To the lake. <laughs> So here's the lake guys, it's a really <laughs> beautiful place, I really recommend you to go and we're going to put a link in the description for the camping where we stayed, it's really really nice. It's totally worth it guys and especially coming from England, it's a perfect drive from England. Yeah definitely. This is what we live for. Oh yeah, <laughs> good coffee. Now we're traveling south. We're gonna go to a lovely lake again. We are going with the flow. We don't have a lot of plans. The plan is just to go to Portugal and then stop on the way to some really magical, lovely places. Man, I'm so happy. The weather is amazing it's here. It's so beautiful. It's about 22 wow. degrees right now and it's like 8 o'clock, exactly. 7 o'clock. And you can hear the crickets. We're going to set up the tent now. Andrea, tell us what you're doing. What's cooking good looking? This is chicken. And here with some couscous and some olives as well. And this is the food for today. So I think we're going to sign out for the night because we're being eaten by mosquitoes. <laughs> yes. Dinner time for everyone around here. We'll see you tomorrow, guys. seven in the morning and it's so beautiful. The sun is so bright coming through the trees. I think we're gonna get Ooh, yeah. Thank you very much. <laughs> See you later. I'm gonna retreat to my cave. <laughs> my friends we Hello. have a caffeinated couple over here we had a really nice morning it's a great day to travel we stayed at this place over here it was 20 euros for pitching a tent including water and electricity it was really really nice the guys that run it are really lovely as well and careful with this guy oh, oh my, my god it's really not a giveaway yeah of course it's a giveaway it's a <laughs> roundabout really really recommend you guys to stay there i'll just put it over there i'll link the, the website below so you can have a look so we're going to seize the moment with this amazing weather before we get to the mountains very exciting <laughs> so we have arrived here to this amazing town called berg saint Valiol. I'm going to put the name over here and it's so beautiful so we just stop here for lunch look at this place It's a really nice stop before we have to go to this Pont du Arc, which is where we're going. A really pleasantly surprised stop. to our destination and this is where we're going to be camping for today. Look at this. Now, 
get the swimming costume, walk down to the river, have a little dip. What do you reckon? <laughs> that sounds amazing. So, is this uh, one of your highlights? Tips? Yeah, <laughs> definitely. It's really nice. This was actually one of the reasons that we did a massive detour. Yeah. So, <laughs> thank you, man. Yeah, I'm gonna say thank you. It was <laughs> it was a good idea. I'm very happy. I um, sometimes I just have to have faith and trust, and this was one of the times that actually came out all right. <laughs> nice one. Well done, you passed. <laughs> We have left now, we're gonna go back and make something to eat. Set of the tent because we haven't done that. And tomorrow morning we really want to see this Pont de Arc because this is like the river but there is an actual arc around here. breakfast we've packed and now we have to go where are we going to the Pyrenees Ooh la la <laughs> But this is a place that it really deserves a long time here. Yeah, I think we're pretty committed to come back here and spend at least a week. Yeah, to this area and yes. then camp a bit. Really cool. Hopefully with a camper van. Let's see. <laughs> cool, we're gonna go now on a drive. Hope you enjoy that. And I think I have forgotten to say where we stayed last night and it was called Camping Les Chauvieux. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing it right. I'm sorry, French speaking people. And uh, but it was really, really good. It was 39 euros, really good pitch in front of our vineyard. So we had an amazing view, including water on site next to the pitch and also electricity next to the pitch. So that was really good. I got a mosquito in here. I hope you're finding this info very helpful. We're going to go now and leave this amazing place. Okay, so we have encountered our first traffic jam and it's just before Montpellier, really good pace, which is really hot, it's 33 degrees right now and the sun has been on me literally the entire time, so I'm going to have one side more time than the other. <laughs> we are going to be in Toulouse in 2 hours and 46 minutes. Another English car over there. Hello my friend. You want some tea? One thousand four hundred tea bags. <laughs> Then we'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Ciao. 
So guys, we're gonna go for a little exploration. Andrea is looking a bit like Dora the Explorer here. <laughs> Super. We also have the same jackets for those because it was part of the uniform and we're not that kind of lame couple. <laughs> well, you know, I wouldn't mind being one of those kind of couples. <laughs> as long as we don't have to share underwear. <laughs> <laughs> so it's very pretty around here. The camping spot that we're at is called Lilac. And that is because it is right next to a lake. We paid 30 yes, euros. 30 euros yesterday because it was Saturday and today was 24. 24. So it's really, really good price. It's super clean. The toilets are mm. immaculate. Yeah, this is definitely, and it's got four stars. Yeah. So we've stayed in two, th two stars, three stars, and four stars now. Yeah. And um, yeah, I mean, like this place, the food was amazing. Super. Man, like uh, the best vegetarian pizza I've eaten in a long time. Yeah, definitely. Mm. And it was really affordable. It was like nine euros per pizza. Mm. And we just arrived really late, so we didn't want to be cooking. Well, yeah. driving, cooking. And yeah, it was so too much. On. It was too much for mm. for everybody, and uh, <laughs> and we um, yeah we were very tired, but that was very enjoyable, very beautiful views, and hopefully tomorrow is just a little bit sunnier. Yeah, well, not too sunny because we're going to do a bit more. We're going to be doing quite a lot of driving tomorrow. Yeah, so. and Spain is very hot at the moment. So thirty five, and we have no aircon, as we have said multiple times. <laughs> <laughs> Should we wing it that way? Yeah, let's go this way. Okay, let's do that. Let's stay on the left. Any lovers of countryside or mountains, the Pyrenees are must-see. Very, very beautiful. It's very peaceful and quiet and it's like mid-August and it's really fresh air. It smells like lavender and pine trees and grass and just like freshness. It's very pure air. Yeah, I really like this place. It has a really nice Ambiance, it's like, just incredibly different to the other parts of France that we've been to. I mean, like it, it feels more like Ireland or Scotland. All right, let's go and do more exploring. Yeah. Our first blackberry of the year. Mm. Is it good? Delicious. Is it? Oh yeah. You know who are very, very good guardians of a farm. These guys over here. These guys over here, if you Google donkey guarding a farm, you'll see some interesting videos <laughs> of donkeys attacking hyenas and the whole lot. Bye donkey. Bye horsey. We are going to turn around now and find a place with some, what are they called? Vienna Oh yeah. <laughs> it looks amazing. I have to say, we have not been disappointed in the strip at all in <laughs> France with the food. It's so good. So I'm, I got my pan au chocolat fix, but in a different in way. In a different way, <laughs> yeah. We are going to go now and make some food. We need to make some vegetable pasta and then we'll see you once we start making some lunch. So we are going to the local pub right now. We have a night of couscous and world music. Indeed, it's our last day in France. And so this is the perfect way to finish it, in my opinion. We're so lucky because this doesn't happen very often. No. <laughs> and uh, so, yeah, we were told about it and it was just perfect. So, yeah. Down to there. Bring and then along with us. Yeah, and then tomorrow, Spain. Yeah.
Good morning, everybody. I got my pan of chocolate this morning, fresh from the oven, and I got some baguette. Well, this is the perk of being in a camping site, this camping site in France. You get to get some really good yummies, fresh from the oven. Man, this is the best. Yeah. <laughs> the little simple things in life. <laughs> really lovely night last night. You have fun last night? Mm. Yeah. Well, I had a really, really good night last night. Mm. It was so good. Like I am so going to come back here yeah, again. Definitely. I'm actually going to phone the pub and ask them when they're going to have another party. <laughs> <laughs> and maybe just come for that. Because the people were so cool and so welcoming and just so friendly. And the, all the children were so curious to find out about us. And yeah, we're trying to speak French. We are yeah, and I think they were kids. the ones that kind of introduced us to their parents. And then we <laughs> felt very welcome. <laughs> so, yeah. yeah, it was very cool. Yeah. So thank you guys. If anyone's watching from here that was there last night, thank you very much. It was um, a really nice, open, and welcoming crowd. Our kind of people. <laughs> worth mentioning Camp du Lac, probably one of the best camping places we stayed. It was immaculately clean all the time. They had toilet paper in the toilet. As, yeah, because a lot of the camping places don't have toilet paper, they assume you bring your own, which is very understandable and it's, it seems to be the general rule, but that was really welcoming. <laughs> it has a pool as well, but we didn't use it because we were here for a short period of time. But if you are in this area, definitely stay there. I'll leave the link below as well, description below, so you can have a look. thinking about going all the way across Portugal and not stopping in Spain. The reason is, is because we can save money. <laughs> yeah, our cards just suddenly run out of money. Yeah, basically our card is not working anymore. It it's another two and a half hours, so we should be getting there at eight in the evening. Maybe we just go right across Spain in one day. How about that? Yeah, I'm afraid. I just need to get some coffee, that's all. Yeah, we need to fuel this guy over here. I can't believe it. <laughs> I have a key, I just hope it's the right one. You don't know if it's a key for the container. <laughs> <laughs> oh my oh, goodness, quite a state this place is at the moment. Well, we gotta go to streaming. We got a lot of work to do, my friend. A lot of streaming. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of work. But at least the container is looking all right. This is all safe. We got an air conditioner. Yay! And now I can cook. Thank you so much, my love. Mm, we made it back. Yeah. I'm so happy. <laughs> that was a mission. That was such a cool mission. Yeah, Definitely. it was great, but yeah, no chill. Bugs. All the way. <laughs> <laughs> the full power. No shower. Yeah. Definitely no shower. <laughs> we'll see you guys soon. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoy our lovely road trip back home. Anything else to say? Yeah, man, like and subscribe to see how we're going to clean this place up. It's crazy, the state <laughs> of this place. We'll see you guys soon. Ciao. Adios.